I was diagnosed with um, uh, myelofibrosis in uh, officially it would have been uh, January 2014. It was described as aggressive and potentially fatal. I needed the best care. I was referred to the Princess Margaret. I knew the Princess Margaret was one of the top five cancer centers in the world. However, when I arrived, it was outdated and often there was no place to sit. I spent a lot of time here. I was in isolation for over a month. I was put on a clinical trial and I received a stem cell transplant. Today, the cancer is gone. I can't say enough about the Princess Margaret. They saved my life. In the future, I want people to feel and know that the moment they walk in the front door, they will be taken care of like I was. That is my wish. The Princess Margaret Cancer Center on University Avenue opened in 1995. It was designed to treat 7,000 new patients a year. Today, that number is 17,000 and increasing. We need to build our cancer care and research capacity for the future. At the Princess Margaret, we aim to provide future care now. Patients are our partners, especially in clinical trials. The atmosphere of a cancer center should be very supportive. It also should look like this is the place where progress is made. Our vision is to create an atmosphere, an atmosphere of care and excellence. As a world-leading center for cancer treatment, it should be self-evident the moment that you step into the building, feeling that this place is exceptional. This place is going to take care of me. Join us to make the new Princess Margaret Cancer Center a reality. Be part of the $50 million transformation campaign and help advance cancer research and clinical care at the Princess Margaret. People like me and their families are counting on you. Thank you. <laughs>